Welcome to Wise Beyond Bitcoin, where you come for the crypto neo news, education, and opportunities. My name is Lucas. And my name is Ryan. And speaking of opportunities and news, we've got some good news on development and value being added, interoperability to blockchains that we talk about a lot. Well, we talk about a lot of things in blockchain and crypto, not just Ethereum, Bitcoin, we go into EVM chains, the IBC, we have DeFi tutorials to walk you through if you want to learn how to download a web 3.0 wallet, send stake, participate in these communities, and we talk about the latest innovations. So if you like this kind of stuff, you know, do support the channel, subscribe, notification bell, thumbs up, and take a look, secret NFT, secret network, cryptonomics, we talk about the macro outlook as well we don't just look at crypto we look at its relation to the world stage and we've been talking about a lot of things for a long time but right now we want to talk about axelar bitcoin interoperability and osmosis one of the cutting edge decentralized exchanges in crypto especially with the ibc yeah this is a, a huge some huge news uh we've you know, it's been, these pools have been out for, you know, a week or two now. So we're, uh, it's not something oh. that just happened, but it's relatively new. And this is just news, right? Yeah. Well, it's not breaking news, but it's been but out. It's, you know, it's also not financial advice or legal advice right. or commercial advice, just educational entertainment information that we're just sharing. We'll leave all links exactly. below so you can do your own research. That's how we do it. Yeah. So the big news, well, you know, this is kind of a continuing of a theme we've been focusing on. Uh, the the bridges that are being built between the Ethereum EVM world and the IBC. Uh, we've we've been talking about Evmos, uh, the Gravity Bridge is another, and and we have Axelar uh, is, is a new IBC uh, blockchain that is connecting the Ethereum and other other chains to the IBC. And the the fruit of this uh, of the of this marriage is a. A, a, some, a couple new pools on osmosis uh one uh, wrapped bitcoin the other is wrapped eth and these are liquidity pools that you can uh you can put some assets in and earn osmo rewards and we can, we can talk a little bit about that we've we ha i know we have how-to walkthroughs on osmosis showing exactly how to provide liquidity and what you know what that looks like so you know look there for those videos um th this is an awesome opportunity you know for those who are not sure what to do with their assets they're they're you know they're, they're either their bitcoin or their eth and, and they want to see how to you know maybe take these assets and earn stake them and or provide liquidity and earn earn rewards this is definitely an opportunity for that uh, we'll take a look at the pools in a minute and you can get an idea of you know the volume uh you know how many people are contributing liquidity what's what was what that you know how much and then also what are the rewards because that's that's another key that uh you know that's important when you're looking at this to make a decision on you know what do you do you do it or not uh, of course the the incentives the rewards that plays a big a big part of it now this is something we want to focus on super fluid pools so these will be super fluid uh compatible lp uh pools so you can you want to explain that, Lucas, what that sure. means? So we've talked about this before. This is a feature on Osmosis Dex, but as you can see, you pair up wrapped Bitcoin or whichever your tr trading pair, wrapped ETH, you're pairing it with Osmosis, the native uh, coin for the uh, Osmosis protocol on the Dex. When it's super fluid staking, because it's a proof of stake network, you can choose whether you want to take your Osmosis and stake it to support the chain, or if you want to take your Osmosis, and use it to provide liquidity and pair it up uh, with one of these assets. Now, with superfluid staking, you can do both. You can use your Osmo to uh, be here on the other end of the trade, but they'll also use a portion of that osmosis and allow you to receive the staking rewards for supporting the, the network by staking it. So basically, you're earning your staking rewards and you're earning uh, rewards for providing liquidity for the DeFi protocol at the same time. Yeah, that's Let's huge. You know, that's usually uh, the way the, the without super fluid staking, you have to pick one. But in this case, you're able to take your Osmo and earn rewards in two different places. Yeah, so that's very cool. Um, um, what else do we want to say about this? Su super fluid staking, big news, wrapped Bitcoin and wrapped Ethereum. I mean, this is 
kind of a big deal. Now you have exposure, the IBC, Adam, um, obviously no longer, well, there's still Luna, no longer Luna Classic, Juno, um, you've got Secret, I mean, you've Comdex, and there are some other up and coming IBC blockchains, but to bring Bitcoin and Ethereum with the IBC interoperability and through a decentralized, secure cross-chain manner, this is exciting. We've heard about problems with uh, certain bridges, exploits, Cosmwasm and, and certain. Yes. Uh, so to be able to, in a, in a more permissionless way, bring over native Bitcoin or Ethereum or other blockchains and have them wrapped into the IBC. This is so the, what is another good news about this, even though the markets are correcting and we anticipate further correction with traditional markets at large, you're still seeing building going on in blockchain. This wasn't possible several months ago. This wasn't possible a year ago. So when the markets return, people are going to see more roads, more freeways, more uh, innovative cars driving on. So that's, that's the idea is still look for that innovation going in the blockchain and the teams that are still developing. And this is a place. So congratulations to Osmosis for um, what they've been able to accomplish and with the IBC, but for bringing wrapped ETH, wrapped Bitcoin and Axelar network. Um, this is good news. Congratulations to the teams that are bringing this together. And of course, we'll leave all these links below as well as the map of zones. So you can see, because we bring this up all the time, but let's just mention it. What, what is this map of zones? What are, how does this work? Yeah, well, this shows you the various connections between the blockchains that are all on the Cosmos, Tendermit, SDK architecture, making them, uh, putting them in, in a direct communication with each other. And so this gets out, these are all, you know, you can you can take these assets from one chain to another directly without having to go to an exchange like, um, you know, like a third party centralized exchange and swap there. It makes it where many of these you can swap right in the wallet and do a, a direct blockchain transfer just use because of the fact that they're all built on the same standard. It makes them um, it's easy to, to be moved from one to the other. The interoperability is high. And so that's the idea here. Very cool. Um, Asset Mantle, we've got Comdex, Axelar, uh, Kronos, there are, well, Cosmos, Atom, Osmosis, Secret Network, Privacy on the Blockchain, a lot to say about that and, and developments yes. there. So you know, this is just good news. We'll continue to share the developments of the blockchain and crypto and other things happening. I think we pretty much covered this announcement. Anything yeah. else you want to say? Yeah. Uh, one thing I would add is, you know, check out Osmosis, the voting, check out the website and check out the voting tab because there are a few proposals that are pending and it's, you know, it, it pays to participate, you know, the airdrops and the rewards that come from, from having uh, staking Osmo and, ha and providing liquidity, they're enhanced when you vote. So make sure to participate and, um, and, you know, help, help make decisions for this decentralized organization. Absolutely. Participation is rewarding in these protocols. So vote, participate, provide, and until the next time, abide. Have a beautiful day. Namaste, y'all.